So I'm going to want the top of this neck to be just a little bit bigger than the collar that I'm going to use for the soap pump. The reason for that is that clay shrinks as it dries and gets fired. It shrinks throughout the entire process. Most clays shrink about 15 to 20 percent. You can calculate your own clay's shrinkage rate by measuring a piece when you first throw it, measure it when it comes out of the kiln out of the glaze firing, and then you'll know, do the math, and you can find out what the percentage of shrinkage is. So for this, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and collar in this neck, get it nice and moist. Make sure that this is an upward motion as you pinch with your fingers, because if it's not, you'll knock this rim right in. And you can do it with both hands from the inside and outside for part of it, and then for part of it, do it like this. Just whatever you need to get it to be the size that it needs to be. Take your hard rib, keeping your left finger underneath, again, always. And get the shape that you're looking for. And then check your size. That's a little too big yet, so I'll push it in just a little bit more. That's about the right size, but as I said earlier, the top sometimes gets a little bit uneven. Take your needle tool and just push it in using your left finger as support and cut off a piece so that the top is nice and flat. And this rim is going to be, it's not going to be showing because it's going to be covered up by the soap pump in the end. So it doesn't really matter if it's rounded or squared because it won't show in the end.